श्री गणेशाय नम ओम श्री गुरुभ्यो नम नमस्ते टू ऑल माई सब्सक्राइबर्स एंड व्यूअर्स ऑफ दिस चैनल लास्ट फ्यू डेज आई हैव बीन रिसीविंग इंक्वायरीज ऑन हाउ टू क्लियर ऑब्स्टिकल्स विदाउट स्पेंडिंग मच मनी हाउ डू आई स्टार्ट माई न्यू प्रोजेक्ट ऑन अ डिवाइन नोट हाउ डू आई गेट द मनी विच आई एम सपोज टू रिसीव फ्रॉम अ क्लाइंट ऑफ माइंड विच इज लॉन्ग पेंडिंग हीज डिलेइंग और शी इज डिलेइंग हाउ डू आई वर्क दट आउट how do i um, start my new home like i want to start the construction of my house and i see lot of delays in paperwork and uh, getting the men and material how do i do that i want to start everything on a divine note so what do i do so we all know that ganesha is the go to god for this we've uh, since childhood been praying to lord ganesh we know that uh, you know we in hindi we say shri ganesh ki je which means we you start with prayers to ganesha that means you've started something already on a divine note so what is it that you need to do to clear your obstacles how do you do that so we all uh, generally what do we do we go to ganesha temple we pray we offer archana or pushpanjali or uh, abhisheka we do pradakshina namaskaram we do all these rituals which are basic which has become more or less a part of our life so apart from that what is it that you need to do to gear up to the next level so that hurdle free smooth path is paved for you what is it that you need to do very very simple all you need to do is on a tuesday or a wednesday tuesdays are auspicious wednesdays are also good go to a ganesha temple offer 108 coconuts how do you do this offering basically you need to break the coconuts 108 now in number so one by one you can take the coconuts and break it outside the temple with the permission of the temple of course before you do that you go to the temple inside you do the archana you do the get the abhisheka done do the pushpanjali do the pradakshina and pray that you are starting this project and you need the blessings this particular money is due to be received and you've not received it and you seek his blessings to clear that for you so that he can make sure that you know your adequately blessed without obstacles and obstructions and you know the people who need to pay you will pay you. so these various uh, things are there various remedies are there which you can do uh, to clear the obstacles this particular remedy is highly highly effective time tested works wonders it's work wonderfully well for my clients so you go to the temple and you make a prayer and say ganesh ji this is what i am praying for and symbolically i am breaking all the obstacles all the blocks in the form of coconut i'm also breaking my ego which i feel like you know everything is my effort no it's m- more of your grace with which i am going to achieve things so you know i'm breaking my ego also so with these kind of thoughts you you break 108 coconuts many temples priests themselves help you in breaking the coconuts so that's also a good thing but at least a few you need to do from your hand then it's highly effective you break the coconuts and then uh, go back to the temple inside pray again saying thank you for making this happen obstacle free and then you see things start happening i have seen people get back money from the clients doing this remedy i have seen people who were struggling to build house start the construction of their house paperwork men material getting things done coordinating was a big issue for them they got this done it helped them then i also saw people who were supposed to get family inheritance uh for a long time it was pending and you know even people in the family were not ready to discuss so discussions started happening and movement started happening in that so and new projects when you begin your new projects or a new business this is a very very important ritual to do because it's very very cost effective and once you do this everything is hassle free you don't have to struggle at all so it's a clean smooth drive so which is why uh, i suggest you do this so once you break the coconuts don't pick it up again and take it home just leave it so beggars on the road can pick it up or some devotees themselves will take it you don't need to take it you just offer it you break the obstacles don't take the obstacle back home so it's like that so that is the symbolic way of doing and uh, as i would always believe and recommend please offer some donations some small way of helping the beggars there dan or get them food food packets feed them give them water see the more you do the merrier it is but the bare minimum that you need to do is this breaking the coconut so try this remedy and let me know how it worked for you
on the comments below thank you namaste mm -hmm.